Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that Steve chooses three cards without replacement randomly from a pack of 52 cards. What is the probability that the first card drawn is a queen, second is again a queen and third is a jack? Now before starting the solution of this question, we should know a result. And that is, when events A and B are dependent, then probability of the event A and B is equal to probability of event A into probability of the event B following the event A. Now this result will work out as a key idea for solving out the given question. Now let us start with the solution of the given question. Now in the question it is given that Steve chooses three cards without replacement randomly from a pack of 52 cards then we have to find the probability that first card drawn is a queen second card is again a queen and third is a jack so let event A is drawing a queen and event B is drawing again a queen and event C is drawing a jack. Now it is given that the cards were not replaced it means when he chose first card he did not replace it and chose the second card so in the first draw there were 52 cards in the second draw cards left were 51 and in the third draw cards left were 50 this means events A, B and C are dependent events. Now first of all let us find the probability of event A that is we will find the probability of drawing a queen randomly from a pack of 52 cards. Now we know that in a pack of 52 cards we have 4 cards of queen so in the first draw probability of drawing a queen that is probability of the event A is equal to number of favorable outcomes which is 4 upon total number of outcomes that is 52 now in the second draw, 51 cards are left. Here we have to find the probability of drawing another queen. Now in the first draw, a queen is chosen randomly from a pack of 52 cards and this card is not replaced. It means in the second draw, we are left with 3 cards of queen. Now in the second draw, number of queens left are 3 and total cards left are 51. So the probability of the event B following the event A is equal to 
number of favorable outcomes that is 3 upon total number of outcomes which is 51. Now the event C is drawing a jack and in this third draw we are left with 50 cards. Now in the third draw number of jacks are 4 and total cards left are 50 so probability of event C following the event B is 4 upon 50 now we have to find the probability that first card drawn is queen, second is again a queen and third is a jack. Now from the key idea, we know how to find the probability of dependent events. Now here, the event A, B and C are dependent events. So here yeah, the probability of the event A, B and C is equal to probability of event A into probability of event B following the event A into probability of the event C following the event B. Now this is the probability of event A. This is the probability of event B following the event A. And this is the probability of the event C following the event B. Putting all these values here, this is equal to 4 upon 52 into 3 upon 51 into 4 upon 50. Now, 4 into 13 is 52, 3 into 17 is 51 and 2 into 2 is 4, 2 into 25 is 50. So, this is equal to 2 upon 5525. So, probability that the first card drawn is a queen, second card is again a queen and third is a jack is equal to 2 upon 5525. So, this is the solution of the given question. And that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.